Aliyup Ginger to stream flip 540 front flip. What the fuck? Stream flip. Wow, that transition to dragon to yo, what's up, guys, and welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Yusuf Moro, and I am a suit workout and case Phoenix athlete. So, after my video reaction of the final battle between the three champions, Danny's Legends, Adrian, and Radoslav, from the competition The Beast of the Bars 2023, today I'm doing video reactions for the female final between Alicia, Malin, and Leia. So, get ready for it. Just a reminder for you guys the final battle has three rounds, so each athlete has three rounds to do of 45 seconds so let's see what they have for us so here we have Alicia starting with her first round going on the high bar muscle up Ayup Ginger to shrimp flip 540 dragon 360 to 360 not stopping she doesn't stop 360 again crazy combo front lever straight one to front lever, front lever raise front lever raise sorry was so clean back lever to back lever raise so good so far one of the best combos from the female at least i have ever seen and hefesto finishing with a hefesto after this combo Complete one, honestly, complete one. Dynamics, strength dynamics, statics, and freestyle. And yes, yeah, she just finished with this mount. So, so far, Alicia did crazy, crazy combo. Like, complete combo, good dynamics, and good uh, strength dynamics as well. And some statics, some clean holds there. So, let's see what Malin will give us as a round. So Malin, she's going on the high bar as well. She's warming up for a freestyle round. Let's see what she will throw on the bar. Let's go. And reverse Ginger. Crazy. To 360 Dragon to 540. Nice, nice combinations here. It was a bit of uh, interruption for the combo, but still she is going on. Straddle planche. Good. Not the best form, but good. To 360. To a straddle hold. Good. And. Back lever. Trying to pull, but. She lost the hold here and the swing dynamics, but still she did a crazy, crazy combo. In my opinion, she should just have done uh, a back lever hold or uh, try maybe to do a straddle back lever pull up instead of trying to do it with full, uh, with full variation because here she lost, she lost time and she didn't hold the back lever. So she lost points, but so far she did a, uh, Good, good combo. Let's go and see what Leia will show us. Alright, she's going on the P-bars. So some statics, I suppose. Full front lever, trying to pull, holding. She didn't hold that much. She's losing like one second hold here. But the form is good, like straight. She's maybe a bit up than the usual or than the normal form. Straddle planche, holding, holding. Good. Counted. Even if it's not the best form, but still, she, she held it. One arm L sit. Straddle L sit. Handstand press in iguana form. Good. Nice. And holding it. Two hours straddle L sit. Okay. So good combinations she's missing some holes there and also i think uh, she's she's losing some power by trying to do for example the front lever pull up in full variation at her place i will do like just 
with a straddle form and go for like full range of motion. So I will get more points for sure because here she lost strength. She lost, she lost, sorry, strength and uh, points for the statics because she wasn't like holding the full two seconds. And as well, she, she was a bit up her like her front lever. But still, she did a crazy round as well. So let's see the second round of each athlete, of each one of them. Let's go. So now we have Alicia again. She is going on the P bars this time. Some statics there. Let's go. Straddle planche. Okay, straight form. Go into handstand. 90 degree push up. Okay. Some strong dynamic here. All right. I don't know how we call it, this one. To a straddle hands, uh, straddle front lever, sorry, in supreme form and a straight, straight front lever. Back lever, then raising to a back lever again. And I don't know if it's counted as a pull as well. But still, she did a crazy round again with the statics this time. So overall, she did a good round with the statics, starting with a really, really nice straddle planche, even though she w she was going a bit in a, into a dead planche, but like just a little bit, a tiny bit, but it was a straight form. So it was really good and counted hold, I suppose. And with the strength dynamics that she did, the uh, 90 degree and everything, she was really doing a good job. Let's see Malin what she will give us here. And she is going for the P bars as well. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's see what she will throw here. Let's go, she looks really motivated here. Let's go. Front flip, what the fuck? Front flip re grab on the P bars to a straddle plunge. Crazy. To a straddle press, handstand press. Handstand push up. Nice. She's doing good so far as well. Crazy. Front lever pull up. I don't know if it was really counted. Again with the back lever like uh, with the back lever like she did before. Okay. Good. Crazy front flip on the P bars. I think she is maybe one of the first female athletes doing this trick on the p-bars so <clears throat> sorry just crazy i wasn't expecting her to do this i already saw some uh, stories on her instagram like doing this front flip but didn't see i didn't saw her mastering this move before so big up for her for doing or to throwing this uh, front flip re grab but for the back lever just Again, I think it's going to be better if you do something that you master, especially in competition, because if you, if you do, if you do something that you are not sure about it, uh, if you are not sure about doing it, sorry, you will just lose points if you don't success. So here, for example, she didn't get to do the pull. So she lost strength dynamic points and uh, static points. But overall, she did a crazy combination there with the, with the straddle, with the front flip, with the handstand push. Really, really good round. Let's go and see Leia what she will show us this time in her second round. All right, Leia, she is going on the high bar. So I suppose some freestyle right here. Okay. Dragon 360 to 540. Crazy 540, no touch. Must lap going up there. E set. Shrimp flip. Wow, that transition. To dragon, to ginger. Oh, no. It was really a crazy combination. I think maybe the best. F if she um, if she got the, the ginger, she would have done like really, really the best combination of this combination. So back lever. Back lever. Okay, after raise, 
and yeah she finished so like i said if she got to do the ginger after her dragon fish xc she will have done the best uh, combo i think of this final it was unfortunate for her but still she did a crazy transition for example from the e set to the shrimp it's the first time i'm like seeing um, a girl doing this transition so big up for her as well and for her round it was really really a good one she is still missing some statics right there but she did really a good job let's go now with the final round of the three of them now alicia will go for her final round and she is going on the high bar again let's see what she will throw this time Let's go. Starting with the Hephaesto. All right, good, clean one. And mix grip Ginger to reverse Ginger to shrimp flip Ginger again. Okay. Good, good combination so far. Straddle front lever. One of the cleanest I, I have seen. To a back lever. Holding to a one arm back lever. And holding it. Good. And she's done. So, so far it was a really good combination of static string dynamics with dynamics. Not like the craziest freestyle, but still she, she managed to do a really, really good round here so let's see what Malin will show us in her final round let's go okay she's going on the P bars again full front lever missing some holes here let's go let's go swaddle plunge holding 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 good counted even not the best form but still to uh, visit then going to straddle front lever full up it was a bit better than the first one than like the, the first yeah than the round before back lever holding it this time so good job here raise to hold okay i prefer when she hold the back lever than trying to do a uh, back lever pull up when it may be not counted and for her case I think it wasn't counted for sure okay so she managed to do a really good job again she managed to do a really good round even though she was missing some static holes here for example for the full front lever in at the beginning but still she managed to do a really good round with some swing dynamics there and some holes as well for the planche and for the back lever for example as well so good job Molin. let's see the final round of leia final round of leia let's see what she will throw so she is going on the p bars again mix a grip press to handstand iguana handstand going to swaddle el sit no hold there front lever missing one second hold there straddle holding it uh, okay doing some pull-ups i don't know if it was really counted the first one with the straddle she's losing some combo points here like each time stepping on the floor to ease it or visit to a straddle else it she's really missing some statics right there okay see she just finished her round so here she was missing a lot of points for combos like every time stepping on the floor and for the statics missing some a few seconds as well in like yeah for most of her of her moves i would say she did she did a good job overall but i i don't know if she wasn't like really focused on this round but still she managed to do a good round as well so my expectations for this battle um, 
I'm gonna start with the combo category. It goes for Alicia for sure. Then for the freestyle category, I would give the freestyle for Malin, especially for what she did on the first round and the front flip. But there's like not a big difference between her freestyle and Alicia's freestyle. I think the front flip regrab made the difference, like a little bit more than uh, Alicia. Then we have the statics. The statics, I will give it as well to Alicia. So Alicia, she has two points already, one point for, um, for Molin, for the freestyle. Statics and combos for Alicia. Then the strain dynamics. The strain dynamics, I, will, I would give it to Alicia as well. For her Hephaesto and her straddle front level raises, like clean ones, at least uh, maybe the best raises in uh, this final. So Alicia gets combos, statics, strain dynamics. Malin will get the freestyle category. And yeah, so from here, I will give the first place for Alicia. Uh, I don't know if I pronounce it well, Alicia or Alicia, sorry, if I'm not saying it right. So Alicia gets the first place in my opinion. Malin will get the second place. And uh, Leia will get the third place. Leia, she was missing a lot of static points. I know when we are in the competition uh, place, we are thinking that we are holding like two seconds at least, but normally we held less. So my advice for you is to try to hold uh, like three to four seconds, at least in your, in your mind, try to count un until like four. And like that, you will be sure uh, of holding two seconds. All right, so that was my expectations for this battle. Let's see the results. Starting with the third place, we have... So we have Leia, as I expected. And I think she deserves the third place, at least in my opinion. Now let's see the second place and the first place. And Alicia! Alicia was last year's winner, so needed to And yeah, by the way, Alicia was uh, the winner year, of the last year's the Beast of the Bars the 2022. And the winner so this year will go goes to Marlin. To Marlin. Marlin, Marlin she, she got the first place. Okay, uh, I really didn't expect that. I mean, she did really a really good job. I don't know, um, maybe the judges saw it differently. Like I said, it's still my opinion. But congratulations for Molin and yeah, Alicia. She will get second place, obviously. So congratulations for the three of them, Alicia, Molin and Leia. I really didn't expect uh, these results, but still, like I said, it's just my opinion. Maybe the judges saw it differently and i'm not like perfect as well so we never know so yeah that was all for today's video congratulations again for the three of them they did really an amazing job and for you guys if you like this kind of videos let me know in the comments make sure to put a like and share it maybe if you want or if you like the video and yeah that was all for today if you have any specific video or battle that you want me to react on just Put it on the comments as well and that's all have a good day guys and see you in the next video